If you have purchased the Litchi app, which of course is now compatible with the DJI Mini 2, the Air 2S and the Mini SE, but you're still having problems getting connected, then hopefully in this video I'm going to point something out that should fix the problem. So let's get into it. Excitement for drone operators of these three drones is absolutely off the scale right now. Since DJI released their software development kit for these drones, or SDK for short, we have had an influx of third party applications such as Litchi, which is the one that I've commented on my channel or featured on my channel that basically give you those valuable added value features that you guys have been wanting. Some of these features include GPS follow, waypoints and one of the coolest ones is full on active track as you can see in this example on screen however quite a great number of you have actually commented to say for some bizarre reason it is actually not working with your device whether it's down to the samsung s21 specifically or whether it is actually down to the android 12 i'm not entirely too sure because my device is working absolutely fine however i'd just like to point out that litchi have actually today offered an update through the Google Play Store. Now, don't forget, this is slightly different to the DJI Fly app. It won't prompt you that there is an automatic update. You will have to go to your Play Store to be able to update it. As you can see on my screen that there is one available, and this, from reliable feedback that I have received on my channel, if you update, this should fix those black screen problems and connectivity problems with drones such as the DJI Mini 2 and of course the other two I've mentioned, the SE and the Air 2 S. Now, just to let you know, I have covered Litchi quite extensively on this channel so far, including quite an absolutely immense active track test uh, where I see if I can follow my car. And spoiler alert, it's really damn quite good. So I would suggest you go ahead and watch it. And of course, there is a competition to win one of three licenses by, uh, yeah, just very simply following the instructions in that video. So do go check that out. Also, of course, I will be covering the Litchi specific app in more detail. The reason I've chosen Litchi is because it's been out for quite some time. I already used it on my DJI Mavic Mini. Uh, so it's well long established and it's the one that I feel most comfortable with. Now, just a quick reminder for you guys, okay? I, as the way that I run my YouTube channel, I trust you, the end operator, to be fully compliant with your local dro drone regulations and laws. Please do ensure that anything you you are doing is actually you know correct as per your country's regulations when you when you are using litchi and do please remember that of course just because you now have these super cool modes on your drone it doesn't give it obstacle avoidance so you can of course hit things and you might want to check with your basically your drone insurer whether it's care refresh or whether it's cover drone moon rock state farm etc etc whoever you are with whether they will cover you for using third party apps now like i said i am going to cover all of this in more additional detail um in individual videos so please do subscribe for some of that content and the competition that i advised in my last video with the active track that will come in my next Litchi feature video which I think will probably be a GPS follow because it's quite easy to put out and it really shows the capabilities of the software. So I just wanted to put you in the picture that if you are having these problems a simple update of the app that you might or may or may not know that was available could fix it. So if you are having these problems and this update does fix it please do let me know in the comment section below. Many of you have actually told me already that it does so I just wanted to put this out for those of you that might not be aware. Until next time thank Thank you very much for watching. See you again soon.